The TSA says holiday travel will not be impacted by its vaccine mandate. Employees had until today to get the shot or get an exemption. 93% of TSA workers are in compliance. Coronavirus positivity rates continue to climb in our area. In Kansas, 8.9% of COVID tests are coming back positive. That's up a half of a percentage point in one week. In Missouri, 9.3% of tests are positive. That's up a half of a percentage point since Wednesday. There's a push to restrict the federal vaccine mandate in Kansas. Kansas. KNBC 9's Michael Mahoney was in Topeka for the special session that continues at this hour. Here at the state capitol in Topeka, the House has one version of this mandate restriction bill. The Senate has another. They are now spending their time trying to agree to cut a deal. Republicans think the federal vaccine mandate is an illegal overreach of Washington, dictating businesses with 100 workers or more that they have to have all their workers get shots. What's next? I mean, they're going to start loading unvaccinated into cattle cars and keeping us segregated. John Epley is an Atchison doctor who's given many shots. I personally have not seen any serious side effects from the vaccine that I have administered. The two main components of the Kansas restriction, a broad, no questions asked, religious exemption from getting the shot and letting people who get fired for refusing the shot to collect unemployment insurance. House leaders are worried about loading up the bill with too many items. My concern is if we do go too far, that this is going to be thrown out in court, and that's the last thing we want to happen. Democrats think the courts will settle the vaccine mandate and not any state legislators. We can feed our constituents a bill of goods. We can tell them that we did something. Finding a compromise has not gone as quickly as they had hoped. There is the possibility this special session stretches into Tuesday. Michael Mahoney, KMBC 9 News, Topeka. The Kansas Chamber of Commerce is against the bill, saying it could lead to unintended consequences for businesses.